Bringing education, technology, and industry together is a philosophy that's at the heart of the success of Shanghai's Chongqing University. Nowhere is this innovative approach to education better evidenced than on the university's Jiading campus, where several major international industrial and automotive giants have established a presence. As for the future, there seems every possibility that this marriage of education and industry may be spread nationwide. Since the man behind it, Wang Gang, is now China's Minister of Science and Technology. But our program looks back at this time in this university when he was the president of it. Two thousand seven is a special year for Tongji University, one of the most prestigious universities in Shanghai. It is the year when it celebrates its one hundredth anniversary. Tongji University has been compared to a huge historical tome, with page after page dedicated to observations, both rational and passionate, on China and the country's urban development in particular. Tongji University was established in 1907 by a German doctor living in Shanghai at the time. Originally, it was planned as a medical institute. By 1927, it had become one of the leading universities in China. In 1952, after the founding of New China and the restructuring of the system of higher education across the country, Tongji made civil engineering and architecture its key areas of specialization. However, following the launch of China's opening up and reform in the late 1970s, Tongji restored itself as a comprehensive university, expanding its disciplines to such areas as the environment, energy resources, electronics, machinery, and road and rail transport. However, it has retained its leading position in the civil engineering field. Statistics show that of a total of 60 major bridges with a span greater than 400 meters under construction across the country, Chongqi University has been involved in the design building of 43. Since 2003, the university has invested altogether 30 million yuan in establishing 16 training bases in the fields of civil engineering, the environment, electronics, information technology, and automobile development. It encourages its students to be creative. And provides them with every possible support. The students are encouraged to come up with their own proposals and to apply for support from the university. Their practical experience is considered an essential quality of Chongqi graduates. Wang Gang has been president of Chongqi University since 2004. In that time, he has introduced some new ideas to the old university with their roots in his personal experience and professional background. Born in 1952 in Shanghai, Wang Gang was sent to receive re-education in the countryside at the age of 16. In the late 1970s, he was selected to go to college. First, the Northeastern Forestry Institute, and then Harbin Industrial University, where he studied highway and bridge construction. In 1979, he became a postgraduate student at Tongji University, majoring in mechanics. Six years later, he went to Clausthal University of Technology in Germany, where he was awarded his doctorate. At Clausthal University, he achieved a major breakthrough when he produced a mechanism that reduced automobile noise by 80%. After getting his doctorate, he worked for the Audi company in Germany for 10 years, and in 1998, he was voted one of the 10 leading professionals in the automobile industry by a leading industry journal. But then, just when his career appeared to be reaching its peak, he made a surprising decision: he chose to return to China. 2000 years of Christmas, I left God very close. I was just that night. 大家都在过平安夜的时候，我登上了飞机，离开了我已经生活了十五年的德国，我无怨无悔。我当时的理念就是说什么呢？我万刚就要凭着我的能力，在社会上去看一看，能做到怎么样一个程度。Back in China, Wang Gang was appointed a professor at Tongji University. At the time, he didn't have his own house and had to live with his mother. He was earning in a year what he had made in the months at Audi. 
In 2001, he became head of the Chengji Automobile Institute. In the same year, a key research project on electric automobiles was launched. Wang Gang was appointed leading scientist in charge of the project. Under his leadership, the staff and students of the Chengji Automobile Institute were responsible for the most complex, the research and the development of the fuel cell. Back then, it was a brand new technology. When this project was launched, everyone thought it was a future development path, but in fact, they didn't accept it. 会完全认可。Two years later, in August 2003, the first fuel cell car, the Excellence Number、no. One, which was designed entirely by Chinese expertise, was launched. A year later, an updated version, the Excellence Number、no. Two, was exhibited at the Sixth International Nature Friendly Automobile Competition, where it was the focus of considerable attention. It was in the same year that Wang Gang was appointed president of Chongqing University. He regarded this as another turning point in his life. So, as the head of this university, he faced the biggest challenge: how to expand the scope of scientific research to make it feasible to adapt our university campus. 和学科布局的调整，我们和全体班子一起做出了决定，也就是说，把我们的强势的、能够社会紧密结合的一些学科进行调整，借着学校呃校区布局调整的机会，我们把我们和装备制造业、现代装备制造相关的学科都迁移到了嘉定校区。Jiading District is a suburb of Shanghai. In 2001, plans were drawn up to develop it as a production base for the international automobile industry. In 2004, Chongqi University moved its automobile and software institutes to Jiading. So, the Qirui Research Center was moved from the Chongqi University of Jiading. The Qirui Research Center was built in the neighborhood of the Qirui Research Center. 大众的这个发呃开发部变成了真正的开发中心，包括丰田的开发和培训中心也悄悄地搬到我们的校区的后边。这种聚集形成了对区域经济的一种发展的能量，也这种互相的互动，这是我们校区布局的一个很重要的环节。The Jiading campus facilitates the communication between the university and the industry. While studying on the campus, students from the Automobile Institute have the opportunity to learn at first hand about the core technologies that are essential to the real automobile industry. The teaching is closely associated with research and industry. Recently, students at the Automobile Institute have developed a new type of car that, on one liter petrol, can travel as far as 331 kilometers. The success is due in part to Wang Gang's philosophy of bringing expertise from abroad. Professor Yan Zhi Gang has worked for NASA and GE, and is now lecturing at the Chongqi Automobile Institute. At the beginning of 2006, the institute produced the Excellence Number、no. Three fuel cell car and exhibited in Paris, where its outstanding performance and design created a sensation. 出身低微，下过乡，直到到过中国社会的最底层。生活过很长时间，我的很多的东西啊，实际实质于来于我自己的教育背景。正因为这种多宽多方位的这个这个更换角色，使我呢更加学会了从各个角度上的这个换位思维。所以我在当校长以后，给我最大的这个，呃，我第一个就想的就是，到底社会对大学需要什么？这是我深层次的想法，也正因为是这些想法，促进了我们的规划。Some people say that Wang Gang's greatest talent is his remarkable ability to bring education, technology, and industry together. Not long ago, he faced another turning point in his life. He was appointed China's Minister of Science and Technology. From returning overseas scholar to minister, it took him just seven years. 
Wang Gang himself has complex feelings when he reflects on this rapid role change. Need longer time to reflect, longer time to study, longer time to understand. It requires you to reflect and reflect. It requires you to do more things. This is a big step. Those who are in front are also ready for the future.